All right, now I gotta get the solar motor off here. Okay, I wanted to get the beginning, but it was a little frenetic at the launch because there's two other guys uh, that have uh, creek boats, which was really cool. So they had uh, like cool little boats. So anyway, I had to get in real quick. I kind of wanted to get the, you know, be getting the boat in the water and all, but that wasn't going to happen. So anyway, I hear a boat coming, so I'm going to kind of chill out a second because I can hear him screaming in here so my name's John. John I love your boat thank you <laughs> <laughs> uh, you to put me in a magazine? <laughs> I am I, I might I don't know you'll be in my video that's for sure <laughs> I don't know if the GoPro is picking up all of the flying things in the air. Like there's dragonflies and all kinds of bugs. So far, I'm um, good. I haven't gotten bitten by any bugs or anything, but man, there are a lot of them out here. All kinds of flying things. Anyway, it's beautiful. It's so nice having Scooty because I can, you know, really get around. I can really explore now. The guys um, back there, they have um, two creek boats and uh, they're from Lugolf. So, uh, really nice guys. They're awesome boats. Anyway, I'm going to make my way out to the big waters and see what I got out there. Okay, there's a whole area that's really calm. Like the water is really like glass here. Um, I know the guy in that boat, the last boat, the John boat was saying that the current was really strong, but he must be talking about the, out there on the main area because it is like glass here, if you look. And honestly, I think you could stay just right within this area. It's huge. Um, and just fish in this area because there's enough here that you don't even need to be out on the main drag area. So anyway, it's, uh, it's really calm. It's hot. I'm glad I have the umbrella. But it's really calm waters today.
place is awesome. I don't know why you would need to even go out to that main area. You just stay around here. It is so big in this area, and I, I, you could fish here for, like, you don't need to even go out there to Lake Marion. You could stay right in here and do your fishing. It's fantastic. Okay, I still haven't found my way out <laughs> to the main area. It is like a maze back here. Um, I found another little area where you could kayak back here or fish or, I mean, it's, it's, a, it's not a wide opening to get back here, but you could get back here with a John boat or a kayak or whatever, but look at this. And this place, this is a whole, other area to explore. 
This place is huge. There's so much to see here. Um, I, I just, I, I don't know that you really need to go, you wouldn't really need to go that far to just be exploring, because there's just so much here, and it's like endless. So I ran into a guy named John, and he was with his um, son, Freddie, I think, and they had sneak boats and, or, you know, creek boats, and uh, he uh, gave me some pointers on how to get out of here and navigate. It's, uh, it's like a maze here, but it, uh, it's really endless places to explore, and if you're on a kayak, um, it you can go just about anywhere. So it's, um, you know, you could, you could spend, you could spend forever in this place and probably not see it all.
I'm pretty sure this is an ant nest. Yeah, they're in there. They're way down there. Oh boy. Okay. Well, it's ant season. Okay, well that was fun. Um, I got the boat on the trailer. Uh, and I'm ready to head back. So, Scooty is ready to go. Uh, it was a successful adventure. So I'm looking forward to the next time being here.